See what this shirt says? Child Predator. Get it? It's a baby predator. Child Predator. You know, some people take shirts like this, you know, offensive. Honestly, what's wrong with a shirt like this? And, you know, when I wore the shirt today, I wasn't expecting the outcome that came out today. Speaking of child predators, what may you ask am I talking about? R. Kelly. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. R. Kelly was found today. He was acquitted of 14 charges of uh, minority uh, youth po po pornography, whatever the hell you want to call it. You know, and, you know, he, he, first thing that comes to mind when I think about this is, you know, they always tell you uh, a jury is made up of uh, your peers. So I guess R. Kelly's jury was made up of African-American pedophiles that are former Grammy winners, which is why he got off. Get it? He got off. Anyway, um, bad joke. Now, you, you got to think about it. Now, this shit happened, like, years ago, I think when, uh, I, I, I forget how old he was, but the girl that accused him of all this shit was, uh, is now 23, and back then she was 13, so you're talking about something that's been going on, what, 10 years now? And, and, and you gotta want, yeah, it just makes you want to, this guy pisses on a fucking 13-year-old girl at the time, but yet gets off. Now, now I know, you know, all the videotape off. Oh, well, the guy in the videotape didn't have a black mole, which, you know, R. Kelly has. You know, if the girl in the video doesn't look like the girl at, you know, is accusing him of all this shit. Yeah, no fucking shit, people. It's ten years later. People don't look the same ten years. And who's to say, okay, that this really didn't happen? I mean, you know, all right, a mole, mole, whatever, you know. I don't really, I don't fucking bite, you know, he could add it, you know, shit happens, you know, plain and simple, you know, but, you know, you know, like, when I talked about in, you know, the whole Sean Bell situation, you know, people get pissed off that, you know, all the cops, you know, Sharpton and all them got all pissed off. You know, that the cops got, you know, co cops got acquitted and, you know, found not guilty on those charges. And yet, a black man is acquitted on shit like this, and they don't say a fucking word. Okay? Now, what if, I don't know, what if the Klan and, you know, and all their supporters decided, you know, to protest that, R. Kelly got off because he fucked a 14-year-old girl, 13-year-old girl, whatever the case. He's a fucking pedophile, plain and simple. But yet, you know, it's okay because he's got money and he's a Grammy winner, just like, you know, Michael Jackson, except he likes to fuck little boys. Meanwhile, R. Kelly was fucking little girls. But it doesn't really matter, people. Simple fact of the matter is, people can say what they want, do what they want. He got off. Michael Jackson got off, O.J. Simpson got off, but O.J. Simpson wasn't guilty. I can tell you right now, I may be a white person, but I wholeheartedly believe that O.J. Simpson had nothing to do with the murder of his wife and her boyfriend, because nobody working at a fucking restaurant will bring you back your fucking glasses or whatever the fuck he was supposed to bring him back to her. Excuse me. <coughs> Shit just don't happen, people. I know it, you know it, so, whatever, R. Kelly got off, should he have gotten off, I don't think so, because, you know, sex with a consenting adult is one thing, sex with a minor is another thing, now, I mean, you know, you can draw the line 17, 18, you know, whatever, you know, depending on where you live, that's legal, but 13 is kind of pushing it. Unless you're a 13-year-old fucking another 13-year-old, that's one thing. But this guy was a lot older than 13. So, in closing, I would just like to say that I picked a great day to wear this shirt, Child Predator. Now, I just want to say, in closing, that 
I want your people's opinions. I want to know what you think. Okay? Should R. Kelly have gotten off? Did he get off because he was, you know, famous and had money? I mean, who knows? I mean, what if he was, uh, I, 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 I don't know, Bob the Bum that did this. But then again, who's going to have sex with a bum, you know? But whatever. Let's not get into that. You know, R. Kelly's off. Good form, you know. He was ch he was chanting, "Oh my God, oh my God!" You know, and, and the joke about the jurors, you know. Well, actually, I think there was like the wife of a Baptist minister and all this shit. There were black and white people on his shirt, so obviously they found uh, what's that shit word? Uh, reasonable doubt in this whole case. Was this girl looking for money? Was she looking for attention? You know, what? probably. But hey, whatever. All is said and done. R. Kelly is off. His ordeal is over, which he's got nothing to worry about, and he can go on, but on with his life, making music, like that whole fucking Trapped in the Closet series uh, of those fucking videos that absolutely sucked. Bye.